Vincent Laverde has defied the odds his entire hockey career. In 2010, the defenseman went undrafted out of the University of Miami, Ohio. Undeterred, he still hoped to earn a roster spot with a professional team. In the summer, I ended up signing him with Greenville. It was cut during training camp, so I was home for a few weeks. I was driving back to Chicago. I was talking to friends, uh, family, and you know, I had a college degree. I really contemplated uh, just giving it up and going to get a job and you know, starting my you know, professional career, I guess, so to speak. With encouragement from his father, Laverde took a tryout with the ECHL Ontario Reign. Wasn't sure how long I was going to be out here. Thought it might be a couple of weeks. Um, ended up staying the entire year. Laverde's skills and work ethic caught the attention of King's management. Jack Ferrara used to come to a lot of the games. He uh, suggested that if they needed a defenseman to call me up uh, to match at some point. And was playing well my second year in Ontario and ended up getting called up to match. He quickly established himself with the Manchester Monarchs as a trusted member of the defense. In 2014, new head coach Mike Stuthers immediately recognized Laverty's leadership and named him team captain. You could just see that there's a calming influence when Vinny's around. Uh, you can see that the guys really like being around him. They're, you know, very open and will talk to him. He treats everybody the same, whether they're an older guy, you know, he's got the utmost respect for a younger guy. In the first season with Laverty as captain, the Monarchs found success in the playoffs. Big hit by Auger. This one can pound. You really have to dig deep in some of those playoff series, and you know, you really, you really kind of figure out who you are. And we had a great group of guys, guys who wanted to win, guys who wanted to battle every single night. Wheel moving in in front, and a score! He's our captain, and there's a reason he's our captain. He's, he's a great leader. He's a good person. We made him captain in, uh, in Manch, and uh, he led us to a championship. And that's going to do it! The Manchester Monarchs have captured the Calder Cup! Laverty became the first and only captain to raise the Calder Cup for the Monarchs. It was a great feeling seeing, you know, the joy in all your teammates' faces and how happy everyone is. It's just an awesome feeling. The following year, the Monarchs moved west to Ontario, where the second-year captain set new career highs and was named an AHL All-Star. It's amazing how many opposing coaches you talk to uh, before a game or after a game, and they, they talk about Vinny. That means he's doing something well. The few times he's been out of our lineup due to an injury, it's virtually impossible to replace him. And although it's his teammates that received the call to Los Angeles, Laverde continues to lead by example. Hey, on the one that got dumped into my corner, yeah. don't just retreat back to the net front. You can go to one of the corners and I can make a play to you. Okay. You know what I mean? He could sit and kind of sulk and be like, oh, why me? Why am I not the one getting called up? But that's just, I guess that's not in his character. That's not the way he is. Hey, we win it. Retreat to this corner. If he comes to me, I'll give it to you. He really wants us to succeed. I mean, if one of us gets called off ahead of him, he's not going to be the guy that sulks. He's going to be the guy that, hey, good luck, and I hope you don't see you back here ever again. All right, all right, boys. Let's go. Got to make plays. At times, it can be stressful. You know, you're playing well, and you feel like you're not getting rewarded for you playing well. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's something that's it's kind of out of your control. We have to focus on the Ontario Reign and working to get better as a team. He's by no means given up hopes of having an NHL career. I mean, he would love to play for the Kings. Go, 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 go! Next game! Every year, he's in great shape. Every year, there's no let up. Now, having said that, Vinny certainly has no bones about playing with the younger guys and helping them develop. You need to take one, one cross over there, you know what I mean? Because oh. it freezes up, just one. That's why he wears the C, you know, because he's team first. Aside from his own ambitions, 
Laverty's goal is to help his teammates reach their full potential. As a leader, I felt like he's obviously been one of the best captains I've ever had. He wants his team more than anything to just be the, uh, the best it could possibly be. He's a guy you can always depend on. He sets a great example for guys like that, you know, coming up in, a, in the organization. You know, what to be, what to aspire to be when you're older. Despite the odds, Laverty knows with hard work and dedication, his dream of playing in the NHL is still alive. It's exciting because, you know, at any point you could wake up in the morning or get a phone call at night and, you know, you're playing in the NHL. You know, that's, that's your dream. You've dreamed about that ever since you were a little kid. From his standpoint, he's probably looking at it as like, it's the windows closing. The opportunity might be getting smaller. And I try to look at it the other way for him. The more people see him play, means he's, he's like a fine wine. He's just getting better.